Alegrias, I love it. Alegrias. Actually, I'm switching to that tag next. Anyways, anyways, anyways. Let's get it. Robin, Banjo. Thunder. Thunder. Um, <laughs> but Jewel is just like always able to get so much chip damage, but he only came in the beginning and Wei was just able to counter that chip damage with 56, 57 percent of his own. Wow. Grenades do so much. It's just like surprises yeah, grenade... how much they accumulate. Is he dead? No. Oh my god. Oh, I thought, I thought Ray oh, was getting oh. spiked. We out here. We dropping that. That's the Sonic edge guard. <laughs> yeah, you guys. <laughs> Just like gonna keep hitting you with the spleen. Over and over. You see, this is what I see a lot. People be getting Drew to kill percent, and then they think like, all right, he's about to die, and then he brings it all the way back. Oh, and I that's think, gonna I think be the down throw into an up smash. Oh, is that like destroyed that percent? Yep. Okay. Because the up smash will just scoop you up. The up tilt is if you get like the lead on them jumping out. Um, but anyhow, right now, you're talking like 76 percent jewel at 12. Jewel needs to set up a lot of traps now because right now he's not hitting him with those arc fires in neutral. He's not getting much mileage off of like those out thunders and those thunders off. Um, he's out of fact. I don't feel like he's been able to hit Ray aside from that forward and like a good 45 seconds. Yeah, and the reason for that is I feel like Ray's controlling a lot of... Jewel likes to move around. It's like, no matter which way you look at it, yeah, he, he throws stuff, but he likes to move around. Yeah. And if you're controlling a space in front of him and he feels like he can only throw stuff and there's no mix-up to it, then it's like, it's gonna it's gonna really hinder his gameplay. Yep. So my man, he has to figure out how to deal with those grenades because they're controlling too much. <gasps> that was so good. Oh, that was bad air dodge. Okay, we out here. Because he didn't know if he was going to get Bank have to tackle yep. or not, right? So that was a 50-50. If you, have, you cannot, it's physically impossible to react so to, to that. To be 100% honest, if you're in that situation, just bang the wall. That way you don't have to. That's not sending you nowhere. Yeah. Hit the wall, you're gonna be fine. Mm -hmm. Especially if you're at such a low percent, like you're not gonna. You're, you're, like you're, you're Robin. You could recover from that distance. Just bang the wall. All right, so. I, if I were Drew, I'd just be using this game for data. Yep. You're so far behind. You haven't had any momentum yet. Let, let's just figure something out. There we go. Oh. That was a good try. That was a good try. And just like that, this game is actually not a okay. This game is over. Oh. oh. All right. Kind of, kind of a little, little off with your timing there. But uh, for game two, you see Ray banning Battlefield and Smashville. Definitely not wanting Robin to get all like those like potential extenders on the platforms. Not wanting. Ugh, I'm, I'm confused about the Smashville ban more than. Oh no no excuse me he took that back. Oh I was gonna say I think Lila. I mean um, Smashville is a it's a good it's a good counter pick I think. Hmm. I think that's a good counter pick because now he has less time. Like Dre has less space to control so he has to deal with Jewel. And Jewel's not, Robin's not gonna run up on you. So now that the stage is smaller, yeah. he's already like where he wants to be. Oh, you get it. Scooped. He did down B because wow. his 11 wasn't on deck yet. And you know what? I feel like you're exactly correct about like Jewel using that game for data. Because you just see him, like, he's like, he knows you're going to drop down grenade at this distance. And so I've already preemptively arc fired you. And I've and just got it. Blows up in your face. Yep. And so right now, ooh. I'm surprised that Jewel missed that attack. That could have been really, really bad because he just like pushed himself further into the corner. But right now it seems as though they've like both reset neutral. Um, and I see Ray going through that a lot, like drop down up barriers off of platforms. That right. so disjointed. It knocks you up. You're gonna get hit a couple times. It's a really, really good option. Now, I don't know about all that. I don't know about the fact that Ray just side. That shield me. saved them. I mean that grenade. Go Ooh. grab it. No, see people don't pay attention. Go grab him. He's gonna side B into the ledge. Yep. That's a really great alpha move, just keeping him back. The tome almost hitting him. Nice. Yep. Neutral, like, more than enough to take out the stop. And this is definitely a matchup where I think the lead matters a lot. Okay. <laughs> okay. I love the fact that Joel was just like. I'm rolling with this. Yeah. He was able to, like, just improvise on the fly and already deal 37% like that when he's only at 7. I was gonna say only at 58, but now a fellow's at 92. Uh oh. Oh, I thought he was gonna get confirmed on. Swing that bird. And that's going to be the down throw, and that is where he tries to get the up tilt jump boot, but that is not enough to take it. Robin being so heavy, even on Smashville. 
Oh wow, that's really interesting. The grenade neutralizes the other thunder. Yeah. Zone. Grenade is just like a little wall. No. What? Why? Why do you not think he's gonna do that? He's gonna do that. Yep. Do another one. Roll away. Yes. And, and I just love the way that Julie uses Thunder sometimes because it is like a little bit of damage and yes, he'll probably shield it. But all it does is just makes them have this extra thought in their minds of I need to yeah, still be comfortable with something. my movement. Right. It forces an option. Mm -hmm. And that's Robin's game plan. Force an option out of him, hit him hard. It's like very synonymous to I feel like Mega Man Palace or even yeah. Banjo's like eggs. Because yeah, they don't do a lot of damage. They just interrupt you just, and break yeah. your flow completely. Nice you drop from Ray. No Ooh, jump that was almost the stock too, but it was a great air dodge from Joel timing it perfectly. Yeah. I like the idea from Ray, but he did he let that mm -hmm. people that trigger a little too late. Ben just trying to dump him. I don't think the up tilt is going to kill. No. Oh, I was going to say, just take the up tilt, but I guess he, he didn't want to get... Oh, there's no, there, he wasted all his jumps. He oh wasted all gosh. his jumps. Oh my gosh, 65%. That was... You know, every now and then I just see Robin like land something at low percents that just like completely... His moveset strings so well, dude. Any button he gets is going to go into another button. Mm -hmm. They're big, they're huge, and they all do a lot of damage. That's the taser, man. Yeah, I like that Jewel came down to challenge it. Just a smash him. No, you have time. You have time. I don't... Ooh, and that up is more than enough to take out the stock, especially on Smash World with such a low ceiling. So, I think we might be able... We might be seeing the character switch coming off the blade. Nah, I think he's going to go I don't, I don't feel it. I don't feel it. He's going to go the Palutena. What y'all think, y'all? You think Ray's going to switch? I don't feel it. I think he's going Banjo. We're going to go PS2. And he's going to... Oh, nope, we oh. out. Yup. He said, nope. Nope. No. Nope. Jewel doesn't want the Palutena to come out. He said, yeah, you're not getting that. It's gonna be like PS2 Lila. Oh, I thought he's gonna. I thought he's gonna get rid of Lila because he wants to. Let's trap. FD? I think it's Banjo. I think it's Palu. Okay. Yeah. So I guess you guys. Guess he's sticking Cause out. Now, because with... Jewel, I mean Ray was getting stuck on that platform. Yeah. You know, he was trying to shoot his neutral bees, shoot his eggs, drop his grenades. Now that's not an issue. I like, I like the way Jules using this arc fire. It's kind of like mitigating Ray's just play. Just an F smash. <laughs> just sets up attack chip. Yo, Ray's okay. funny, <laughs> Look at all of these tilts and disjoints that he has, and my son just F smashes. Raw. That's what he does. Okay, that's cool. All right, good damage. 100%. Thunder. That grenade is getting so much mileage off for Ray. Yep. It's like making Drew a back his put his own back into the corner. Just even like the notion of like picking it up suddenly limits a lot of what Jewel can do. Right. And it's not even getting hit by it, it's just like the fact that it's just like forcing him to keep playing back and back and back. Roll away. Need the hitbox those. Nice. Wow. Banjo's big boy. That's not killing. Still did so much damage. My and man right. eats all his oatmeal. This is troublesome because it's like everything bounces, everything slowly approaches. Ooh, and that was almost enough to take it. <gasps> I'm surprised that the throw on the connect, but that was a really was great a very good play. back in. He tried to throw on to catch a startup. If you can catch a startup of side Banjo's on Wonder Wing. Yeah. But he was like slightly off on the spacing. He was off on the spacing, but then Led Trump was like, Yep. Ray was, was probably it. still stuck on, like, oh, I'm alive. And then, <laughs> yeah, Led Trump. Up air? No, up air, you get more damage. I think he was just trying to maybe go for the stage control instead of. Just yeah, but up air confirms it's a back air. You got the back air anyway. Oh, well, you right. Um, but regardless, right now, Joel has to find a way to get back to stage, he has to find a way to circumvent. All of you to open Ray's efforts and keep him off. Yeah, like Ray is not even going for like hard hits. He's just like consistently like the stage is mine. Here's my grenade. The stage is mine. Here's my egg. Yeah. Ooh, that's a really great landing down. I, you know, I love the way that Jewel is mixing up his landings and making oh. those down it is so unpredictable. 
he's, because he's, he's getting a lot off of it. He's moving around the grenades differently. Mm -hmm. This is what he needs. That's fine. Was that a frame trap? That was definitely a frame trap. Is he a direction of air dodge? Mm. Nice landing there. You know what's coming. Okay. Again, he's not get hit with that again. Attack. I think maybe he could have gone for an arc fire. Might have had enough time to do that. Nice. Why he grabbed him through it? That was pretty good. Oh, I get it because, like, the fact that Banjo is shorter than his shield. Uh huh. It hits his shield. Grenade when he like releases the shield. Then there's nothing touching anymore. And then suddenly he's able to get the grab, uh, the grab on him and not get hit by that. So smart. Nice, nice jump read from Ray. Oh, you have nowhere to go. Yep. That's the first time Ray, Ray's back was in the corner. And Ray's been, like, rolling away from all the arc fires and shields. So yeah. he had, he didn't have that option anymore. Nice. That's a good trade. Jewel tried to drift all the way in after that parry because yeah. the back hit in there might have hit him. And right now Jewel's getting knocked off stage. It's really, really dangerous. He has to really watch his drift because there's so many things that can happen to Lob and off stage like that, especially against characters like Banjo. He's um, trying to read the tech away. But I don't even think Banjo's tech call even extends nearly that far. But regardless, Jewel getting back on sledge, and it's just surprising like how much of the set is actually played with Jewel on ledge and and uh, yeah. Ray. Yeah, Ray's like, kind uh, of been controlling this the whole time. It's just now that we're seeing Jewel move very differently around Ray's projectiles. Ooh, yeah, down throw Nair. That's so much easier to confirm with the new Nair buffs. Yep, those few extra sh frames shaved off yep. just lets you Three have a bigger window there, for it. I believe. All right, even game, ladies and gents. Nice up B. Great back here, knocking him off stage. He's gonna wonder wing. He's gonna wonder wing back on. That was a really good wonder wing. I think the whole world thought he was going back on. I like the F smash. He F smash because he gets eleven back faster. Robin pro tip, y'all. Whoa! That's it. That's when he gets the F smash punish. Whole set, he was doing dash attack, but right there. He was still, he was at the ledge of the stage. Jewel was confident enough he can have smash. That was really, really well played from Jewel. He and did a fantastic job at yeah, the end. Yeah, that was, that was very good from Jewel. Ray was just a few frames off because Jewel spended everything. He had no double jump. He was drifting back. He called it out, but it was just a few frames too late and he got yep. the shield out on time.